Okay, so um, got some swag from Gorilla Bow um, yesterday um, to include this shirt and this hat. Now, the only reason I'm doing this is it's kind of like a before and after. Even though I'm 26 days into this weight loss process, I should have shown it 26 days ago, right? But I didn't have the shirt. So I'm going to use this shirt to show, <laughs> hopefully at the end of, you know, every, every month or so maybe I'll take a, like a little video in this shirt um, while I'm doing my Gorilla Bow. So ooh, this is embarrassing. Check this out. You see the side view. Now, this is a large shirt. Never again will I fit in a large shirt. However, extra large is definitely doable, right? Even when I get down, if I fit in a large shirt, I've lost too much weight. Okay, so I don't want that. I, I don't want to bulk up, but I don't want to, like, shrink. So, um, I show this picture this in this large Gorilla Bow shirt. Um, not only to say thank you, Gorilla Bow, for the hat, the awesome hat, um, and the shirt, but also to say... Uh, or to show you guys maybe progress um, as I go along. Um, so I guess now I'm going to set up the bow for today. Um, I've been working with been working with some of these different ones. Oof, boy, that's not flattering, is it? It shows the belly button and stuff. So this... This right here, this white one, this is the 100 pound band, and I'm not even kidding you when I say it feels like more than 100 pounds, okay? I'm not a big lifter, I don't have a huge chest, um, and so if normally like if I'm doing free weights and stuff, I don't usually go above 150, um, and I can tell you that this feels uh, like, like 150, I mean look at this thing. So in order for me to get this on, okay, unless I'm doing it wrong, I gotta like, put some arson to it sorry for the for that but I do okay so I'm gonna throw these on there these I'm not sure these these are probably like 50 at least 50 pounds okay um, I know if you go to grill bow you can find the weights or the the band strength and stuff um, so I'm gonna put a couple 50 pounders on here. And then I'm gonna put a really lightweight one because um, I need to do some also some lightweight stuff. But I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's actually pretty easy to put these on. Okay. It's really not difficult at all. And it doesn't take much time. The nice thing about Gorilla Bow, um, besides the fact that it's quick, is that um, I mean you can do when they give you their free work workouts, they tell you to do some free weights too, which I wholeheartedly recommend. But for time, uh, I don't necessarily have time for free weights right now, so I just am doing these bands. But it's also less, man, it doesn't hurt your joints as much. So um, I really like that. Okay, um, the last band I'm going to put on, this is going to be kind of wussy-like, but I need to chill a little bit on some of my leg stuff since I pulled my Achilles yesterday, or day before. Uh, so, it's this little red band, okay? This is not much weight, okay? Now, one of the things I found that I can do in between is I can take another band uh, and do some workouts in between. So, that's really cool. So, uh, I'm going to start out with chest here, right? And again, it's really simple, but here we go. This is the uh, start of my workout today. It's important when you're doing this to keep your core tight, right? Hard to see my core being tight as I've got passive muscle over the top. Yeah, yeah, you like that joke? Okay, but uh, anyway, so that's one rep of that. Then to give me just a skosh of a break, because that's not an easy one right there, um, I'm going to take this and do a little uh, extra, okay? So this is also working the chest and the tries. Um, and a little bit of the shoulders, which I'm finding I should have been doing some shoulder stuff um, all my life, right? I've got some rough shoulders. So it's kind of getting in this area. Um, 
uh, in the tries, obviously, and then some of the chest as well. I gotta finish my reps. Someone will have to count uh, and in the comments tell me how many reps I actually did. I lost count, I shouldn't have been talking. <laughs> I just don't want you guys to be too bored, right? By the way, comment in the uh, comment in the um, in the comment section if if my if I look like an Amish guy with my mustache is short. I think I do. It's not a bad thing. It's just I don't think I should have shaved it so short. Okay, now along with that, right? If you're wanting to get like a total, if you're wanting to get like a total workout. I gotta find my other blue one here. If you're wanting to get a total workout, you can also do um, do some things like with just the bands by themselves, right? You can totally just take step on a couple bands like that. Like say you want to do your your biceps, okay? Now I, I love this. This is a cool thing about resistance bands, and I think uh, Gorilla Bow did a good job of this. So you. You get them where the, you feel the resistance is going to be good, and boom, look at that. Now, if you want, you can switch like this so you get a different arm workout, right? Anyway, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay? See, look at that. Now, you can take, after that, if you want to do your tries, come right up here, right? Okay, hop on it again, on this side, you don't need to go past, I don't know if you guys can tell, but you see how my arm is kind of 90, 90 degrees here, you don't need to go past that when you're in your tries, okay. That's one thing I learned in the military um, when doing exercises and weightlifting and stuff like that is you don't have to, you know, you don't, you don't go down all the way, okay? All right, um, so back to the bar, because um, I'm just going to do one full set, okay? Well, I didn't plan this out very well here. That's okay. So I'm going to do some back stuff, right? And you can see I've got the red band selected that I'm stepping on. Not doing the rest of them because um, of the bulging disc in my back. I don't, I, I want to work on it. I don't want to kill it, right? So you keep in, I bend my legs a little bit. You bend over, right? Make sure you keep your back straight. So if you were to look here, right? I got a pretty straight back coming up, okay? Now, this isn't much weight. I probably should put a little bit more on there, but I guarantee you it'll be a good workout. I'm gonna add just a skosh more um, to do, actually, I'm gonna do my shoulders too. They need some, some more work, All right? So here's a, another shoulder exercise here. Hold it in the middle of the bar, straight up like this, okay? You don't need to go over, okay? I'm probably, my form is probably not perfect. If anybody notices that in the comments, please let me know. Okay. You can do some, some more back. You step on it um, with your opposite leg that you're going to work it. Right? Nice and straight back up like this. Okay, that's another one you can do. I'm not doing that one, it's too little weight. So, and I'm not gonna do a ton of back today. All right, so, thanks a lot for watching. Again, this is day 26. Um, I'm gonna finish my sets and not bore you with the rest. Um, come back another time, check it out. And if you like the both, the Gorilla Blow, or have any comments, suggestions, anything like that, I'll take them. Have a great day.